You were not content to slaughter the people of this land with your highway war. You were not content to black out the sky and burn the land with your hellfire. You were not content to strangle what beauty was left in this land and choke her with tracks of tortured wood and twisted iron. So now you burn the sky and place yourselves above it all. And for what? Order? Profit? The jingle of another brass in your pocket? To place your boot on the neck of a better class of person? We condemn you. The ox killers condemn you to burn as your forebearers did. As all who build altars to themselves in temples of artifice do. Condemnation, yes, but not contempt. Contempt we reserve for your passengers. Mewling, whimpering, complacent supplicants, kneeling at the technological teat, begging for some new machine or serum to save them from savage lessons to be taught by the world below. The self-styled grand architects of your thin, ten toy world cannot save them. Only strength can. Strength that they shall find within themselves or perish below the rubble of our righteous rampage as we rip waking from the heavens. By now you've met the storm chasers, scraptionists who saw fit to find wings and serve as autumn's justice to those arrogant enough to pierce the clouds. My comrades who even now hide amongst your number, have kindly helped these raiders find your city, who even now gnaw and rip and tear at its foundations like a piranha on a bone. To the strong, who've lashed themselves to the deck of your dying skyship out of a misguided arrogance, know that you face the might of the ox killers. To the weak, Know that we bring a swift and merciful end to your pitiful existence. I am called Path of Rust. Let us begin our rapid descent together. <laughs>